Hey guys, and welcome to Minecraft Old Version Tornado Survival, Season 3, Episode 7, I believe it is. Third episode in this new world. So, the only thing I really did off camera was just move the bed over here to look out over there. And you may hear some meowing in the background. That's my cat. So yeah, you might hear that. She's very vocal, yeah. But yeah, so today we're gonna do... I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know what we're gonna do today. We're just gonna continue in this survival world, I guess. I mean, I could have put these like here, but I want this to be like a, I want this to be my house area and then this is like my basement. So actually this, this isn't even the same room. Actually, this is not the same room. This is a totally different room. I might have this just be my storage closet for now, and I'll have everything out here. That might be what I do for now. So yeah. So yeah, that's probably just going to be my storage closet for now. So yeah. I'm going to make two chests for now. Let's make these into planks actually. So we have 22 spare wood. And we'll just do that. And there. That is my storage closet for now. We may take shelter in there during tornadoes. Also, you guys, as you can see, the clouds are lighter right now. And I did actually turn mobs on. And, yeah, I found the setting that was causing the crazy mob spawning during the day. And I changed that setting, so now we're not going to have to deal with that crazy mob spawning during the day anymore, which is very good because that's super annoying. So yeah, that is that. Today we're probably going to do some mining because we haven't really started mining yet. And that's definitely something important to do. So, yeah. Um, maybe I will just exhaust these wooden tools real quick. So that we can move on to the stone tools. I don't know if we'll ever need this. Alright. We might actually need coal. I hear thunder. Alright. We're gonna need more torches to go mining. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely need more. I thought I saw cyclone particles. My eyes must have just played tricks on me. Okay, 22 torches, that's still not a whole lot, but that that's, might be good enough for a short mining trip. But we will definitely need, I don't know why I looked in there, but we'll definitely need some more 
We'll definitely need some more torches. Yeah, and now we can't sleep during the day either, because... Yeah. I'll tell you what setting it was. It was lock server weather mode. At first I turned it to 1, because there was a video by Tanner69046 that um, was like a tutorial on how to get more storms that I watched a while back. And um, so, oh, it looks like there's a storm over there. So, and one of the settings that he changed was lock server weather mode, and he changed that to one. And so I thought that you would get like more storms by doing that, so I changed it to one for me. But then I realized that when I changed it to one, the clouds were like constantly dark and the mob spawning was crazy. So I thought, what if I um, turned it to back to zero? So I kind of experimented with it last night. Like I turned it to zero and I tried to get storms to form to see if turning it to zero would affect the, like how strong storms get. And it doesn't seem to affect the strength of storms but it makes these clouds lighter and it and it puts an end to the daytime mob spawning which were exactly the things I was looking for so yeah so yeah now so if that lock server weather mode setting was at 1, we'd be seeing like a bunch of mobs everywhere right now. But I put it back to 0 and there are no mobs. That storm scares me a little bit. I don't know, maybe maybe I want to hide for now. I was gonna go out and try to do some mining, but I don't know if now is a good time to do that, because we might have a future tornado on our hands, so yeah, a little scary. I should probably make a way onto the ceiling so that I can get on top of the hill and watch the storm. Hold on, let's see if I can do that before a tornado forms. I don't know if I'll be able to do it, but I'll try. Okay, gotta be very fast. I don't even care about storm leaves at this point. Just need to quickly we did it. We now have a way on top of the hill. And we will take shelter when or if this becomes a tornado. Look at this. Look at that mesocyclone. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. It's a tornado. Run! There's another one? We'll, we'll shoot. Oh, this is scaring me a little bit. Please don't hit the house. I just finished the house like last episode. Please, please don't hit the house. I'll take a peek. Oh no. Is it hitting? like right over me. I I'm scared. I'm really scared. I'm, I'm just gonna hide behind this, this log. Logs are pretty safe. 
I think it strengthened, didn't it? Shoot, it did strengthen. It's pulling me. Yeah, you guys, it's it's pulling me. What? What is that? What strength is that? That's like an F2 or F3. some damage. Okay. When this... Okay, it's out of pulling range, I think. Let's inspect the damage. I will repair those blocks in just a minute. So, it took out these two blocks. Oh my gosh, it was right there. Is this a fire nato? My fire nato chances are low. There shouldn't be fire nato. I don't know. That is a big tornado. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is so big. That is so big. I don't know if that's going to be a tornado or not. I hope not, because we already have a tornado. But look at this. It... it started, like, down there. And it broke off a few blocks of my house. But I think I think the hill is kind of protecting my house a little bit. Like, if we had built away from the hill and a tornado hit us, then we probably would have gotten a lot worse damage. That is an... that's like an F3, I think. That's an... yeah, I'm pretty sure that's like an F3. Gosh, that, that, that's a powerful tornado. I wonder if that lock server weather mode setting is actually causing stronger tornadoes. It shouldn't be, but yeah. So yeah, I think, I think if this hill wasn't here, then this whole side of my house would have been gone. Is that another tornado? You guys, I think we have another tornado, I think. I'm not too sure. There goes that one. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. I can see it. That one, the other one's coming into view. It's at least an F1. I think it should be missing. I I hope it's missing, because we already got... We kind of got hit by that one. Like, sort of. Um, yeah, that was... Is putting lock server weather mode to zero is not is not causing tornadoes to be weak. If anything, it's actually making them stronger. Cause that became like an F3. I'm pretty sure that's an F3. And then that's like an F1 or 2. I really wanted to go mining. Is that tornado jumping, or is it on top of a mountain? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go on top of that hill, and I'm going to um, look at that tornado. Oh 
Oh shoot, the sun's going down. But I really want to see this. Okay, I hope we're not going to get too close. I really want to see this though, and see where it's going. We need to go home because it's becoming nighttime and a bunch of mobs are going to spawn if we don't get home like right now. try to find a cave to mine in, but while I'm doing that, I'm also going to be looking at the tornado. Oh my gosh, that's actually really close. I think that's where we just were. That, that is literally where we just were. I should make a balcony up here. Oh, the tornado literally just died right in front of me. It's just dead now. The other one's going out in the distance. Okay. Hold on, let me see something. Okay, you guys, I'm sorry about that. I just um, had to pause real quick to check for a glitch. Oh, yeah, I left Storms at half a day, so, because, yeah, there is another one over there. But, yeah, I just put a forecast down real quick to make sure that a glitch wasn't happening, because, like, that big tornado literally just lifted right in front of us. And there was a certain glitch where, like, storms were, like, would, like, act super weird. Like, they would suddenly weaken. Oh, there's another tornado. But, yeah, they would suddenly weaken, and, but, like, when they weakened, they'd still be strengthening. So, yeah, that's a weird bug that I've experienced before. And I just wanted to make sure that that bug wasn't happening, and it didn't happen. That tornado just lifted suddenly, and... Yeah. There's a third tornado. Yeah, guys, the reason why we got so many tornadoes was because I accidentally left this setting at half a day. I meant to put it back up to one day, but I left it at half a day because of the tests I was doing last night. I just wanted to see, like, if um, that lock server weather mode setting would cause tornadoes to be weaker. Um, so, yeah, but it seems like... It seems like it doesn't cause tornadoes to be weaker. It actually, it's a, if anything, it's causing them to be stronger because all the tornadoes, all three tornadoes we've seen this episode have been F1+. Plus. So there's a third one. After this third one comes and goes, then I'll end off the episode. So yeah. I was, I was, um, 
wanting to do some mining this episode, but that's not going to happen because we had some pretty active weather. All because I forgot to change a setting, but yeah, it makes a good video, I guess. I don't think that tornado is going to hit us. How strong is that going to get? That's like F3 right now. My goodness gracious. And it's going to pass in front of us, which is going to be a very good view. Oh, I can see the grass becoming dirt, like behind that tree behind those trees over there. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is massive. It's getting closer to a little bit. It's getting a little closer. I think it's gonna miss. It should miss. But it might come close. Is it missing or are we gonna get a second hit? Because the tornado that hit us from the hill didn't do that much damage. Because the hill um, is kind of protecting us. But if a tornado hit us from this way, then um, that would cause a lot more damage. Because our house is open this way. So yeah, if this tornado were to hit us from over there, then that would cause quite a bit of damage. We're not going to get hit a second time, are we? Yeah, it should miss, actually, but it might get close enough to pull us. But it can't pull us out of the house because the gap between the fence and the ceiling is too small. But it might be able to pull us around the house. Yeah. I think it's I think it's actually going like that way. So we, we should be okay. But we might be able to see the damage path being formed. I think I can see the damage path being formed. Yeah, I can see the damage path being formed. It's definitely going to miss us. But it's not very far. It's just right there. to an F2. Oh, is it lifting? Yeah. Okay, yeah, it weakened to like an F2. I'm pretty sure that was an F3. So yeah. Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the tornado outbreak that we saw this episode, all because I forgot to change this setting. So... Next episode shouldn't be as active because I changed the setting back to where it's supposed to be, but it did make a good video seeing all these tornadoes, I have to say, so yeah. But anyways, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time, and hopefully, 
hopefully the tornadoes will be less next episode so that we can actually get stuff done. But anyways, again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this tornado outbreak episode. And see you next time. Goodbye.